available on VHS and DVD. Somewhere deep in bear country lives the Berenstain Bear family. Now, bring home the treasured Berenstain Bears in all brand new episodes on DVD and video to share with your family. I think it's a great idea. Featured on PBS. Welcome to Bear Country School. From Columbia TriStar <laughs> Home Entertainment. This I gotta see. Based on the biggest selling book series in history. A real prize winner, Papa. Stan and Jan Berenstain's lovable bears. Oh, they're so cute. Have been trusted by parents for decades. <laughs> Papa, Mama, Brother and Sister Bear teach simple life lessons and family values in every entertaining adventure. These cherished and ever popular stories are now available in brand new, fun filled, and educational volumes. So bring home the Berenstain Bears. Can you believe it? They're bound to be your all new, all time family favorite. The Berenstain Bears. The Berenstain Bears. On DVD and video. You can own the adventure of the Swan Princess on DVD. In a magical land, Odette and Derek were about to live happily ever after. Arrange the marriage. <laughs> Until Rothbart's evil spell threatened it all. As soon as Moonlight leaves the lake, you turn back into a swan. Where is Odette? Now, to get Odette back, Derek and his friends will have to face a sorcerer of unspeakable power. There's danger around us. They'd hurt us if they found us. Our backs are to the wall. No fear! No way, Jose! No chance! No choice. No fear! With Jack Palance as Lord Rothbard. Odette is mine. John Cleese as the voice of Jean Bob. I'm open! I'm open! And Stephen Wright as Speed. Get moving, slow poke. The Swan Princess on DVD. And the adventure continues. The Swan Princess faces a new danger. But with the help of Prince Derek and a few old friends, they'll defeat an evil sorceress. <laughs> you will never get away with this. Whoa! You gotta get out of here, Odette! I've fought the Forbidden Arts before, but I am not going to lose Odette. The Swan Princess and the Mystery of the Enchanted Treasure. And also available for the first time on DVD, The Swan Princess, where it all began. Just in time! 
Hola, niños. Zack and Wheezy are in the middle of their show and tell. And these are our cousins, the twins, Hunky and Dory. Aren't they just the cutest little things? And then there's Grandma Tuck, Grandma Roll, Great Grandpa Twist, and Grandma Shout. That's our family. Nicely done, Zack and Wheezy. Who's next? Emmy? What have you and Max brought for show and tell? Oh, nothing. Just this. Ooh, what oh, is it? What is it? It's called a granite pomegranate. Pomegranate. And each one has a hundred juicy seeds inside. Can we see? Of course. We brought it to share. Oh, wow. wow. <laughs> oh, boy. We just need to Very tastefully done, niños. Who's next for show and tell? See, si, Cassie. What have you brought to share with us? This is my pet butterfly. <gasps> Her name is Bibi. Hello there, Bibi. My name is Max, and this is my sister, Emmy. And Zach and Wheezy, and my best friend, Ord. Ord? Ord, why are you over there? No reason. You're not afraid of butter frogs, are you, Ward? No, are you kidding? I just uh, can see her better from way, way, way over here. Come on, if you get way up close, you can see how cute she really is. Wait, Emmy's right. I'm scared of butter frogs. You don't need to be afraid. She won't hurt you, Ward. Baby is very gentle. See? I'd like to. But I can't. I really, really don't want to be afraid. I just don't know how. I have an idea, Ord. Watch. <laughs> See? She's very nice. Do you want to try feeding her, Ord? Maybe. But what if the butterfrog is still hungry and she bites me? I changed my mind. Don't worry, Ord. Bibi is harmless, and she loves playing with children. How about helping me put these letters in the mailbox? Uh, yes? <laughs> I mean, no. I mean, well, maybe I'll try to stay here for one more minute. Muy bien. I'll be back. Maybe Bibi wants to play with us. Max, that's a great idea. It is? Playing with Bibi might be just the thing to help Ward feel more comfortable around the butterfrog. Bibi loves to hop. It's her favorite game. That's perfect. Bibi can hop along with us, and maybe Ord will join in too. Come on. Love it! Hop, hop, hop. Hop, hoppity, hoppity, hop. <laughs> that looks fun! <laughs> you were right! That was fun! Let's do it again! Or not! But Ord, you know that playing with Baby is nothing to be afraid of. Oh, I don't want to be afraid. But I am. Can you help me think of something else I can do to make me feel less afraid? Let's think. Got it! Remember the funny little hiccupy noise that BB made after she ate the daisies? Yeah? Maybe hearing that noise again will make Ord feel less afraid. It's worth a try. Here, BB. Your favorite, daisies. She is pretty funny, <laughs> and I bet she's pooped. I know I am. All that bouncing has made me hungry. Dragon corn. <laughs> she 
caught my corn. And worse than that, she scared me. That's all. Can I talk to you a minute? Of course, Ord. What is it? Well, everyone has been trying really hard to help me, but no matter what they do, I'm still scared, even though I really, really want to play with BB and not be scared. Why do you think you are feeling afraid? I don't know. Ketsu! Ord! ¿Qué pasa, niños? We were all so busy trying to figure out how to keep Ord from being afraid of BB. We didn't notice that BB went bye-bye. I let her out of her cage so we could play, but now we can't find her anywhere. You mean, she's on the loose? Yes, but you don't have anything to worry about, Ord. BB does. What do you mean? Butterfrogs don't see very well at night, so they're afraid to be out in the dark. If we don't find BB soon, she may be lost forever. You mean she's afraid of the dark too? Yeah. If we all split up, we'll have a better chance of finding her. Cassie and I will go that way. Zacky and I will go that way. Come on, Ord. We'll go that way. Um, I'll just stay here, Max. But Ord... Come on, Max. You come with us. All right. Are you sure you don't want to come with us, Ord? I'm sure. Should I try and help look, or should I leave? Leaf? <laughs> Did somebody say leaf? <laughs> leaf? Get it? Leave? Leaf? <laughs> no, I said leave, not leaf. <laughs> you don't have to bark. Sorry, Sid. I guess I'm a little nervous. Can I tell you something? Hey, of course you can. I'm afraid of a teeny, tiny, sweet and harmless butter frog. <laughs> Not very nice to laugh when someone tells you they're scared. Maybe I shouldn't have told you. <laughs> I'm not laughing at you. I'm laughing at me. Actually, it was on me. <laughs> I can't quite see it. Whoa, it's Baby. I mean, whoa, it's Baby. <laughs> I think she's stuck. Maybe she flew too high. Cassie! Emmy! Hey, everybody! I found her! She's over here! I guess they're too far away to hear me. Can you help her down, Sid? Would that I could, Odd! <laughs> Get it? Would could? <laughs> but I can't. Oh, no! It's starting to get darker. Oh... What should I do? She must be really scared up there, but if I try and help her, I might get scared too. Oh, what am I gonna do? Hey, hey, it's like I always say, Hod. Sometimes you gotta go out on a limb. Huh? You know, do something even if it feels scary. You're right. That poor sweet little butterfrog needs my help. I think I can do it. Okay, here I go. You're shivering. Don't be afraid, little butterfrog. Everything is going to be okay. Are you listening to yourself, Ord? Don't be afraid. Everything is going to be okay. Hey, hey! You did it! I did do it, didn't I? And you know what? I think BB was more afraid than I was. <laughs> that tickles. <laughs> I'm sorry, Cassie. I don't know where she could be. Me neither. I found her. You did? Yeah, and even though I was really scared, I flew up high and picked BB up and took her down, and then she licked me on the cheek and made me laugh, and... Look, Lord, your dragon badge. It's glowing. Gee. I must have been really brave. Yeah. Muy bien hecho, Ort. I wish, I wish to use this ride to go back home. Until next time. Drawing B.
Speedy. And I'm drawing a big red pomegranate. I think my butterfrog is hungry for your pomegranate. Oh, no, you don't. <laughs> Carousel. Hey, how come you're dressed like that? I was playing Charo. Charo? Wow, I love that game! Mm. What's Charo? A Charo is a Mexican cowboy who takes care of cows and camps out under the stars and rides ponies. Yeehaw! Yeehaw! I want to be a Charo! Me too! Can a girl be a Charo? Definitely. Yeehaw! Whee! <laughs> Phew! That's too much running around for me. I'm exhausted just watching them. We don't have to run around. We can ride the ponies at the Dragonland Carousel. <sighs> That's what I was trying to tell you. There it is! Good choice! Yeah! Bronco is one of my favorites. Thanks, mister. Uh, call me Gamboli. Thanks, Gamboli. I'm Max. You know, Max, if you ride these ponies long enough, they will come alive. I can't wait. You know, I once met a merry-go-round pony named Winnie. Really? Oh, she's an old friend of mine. I hope you enjoy the ride. <laughs> Everyone ready? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Not loving it! Yeehaw! Emmy, if we ride the ponies long enough, 
they come alive, just like Winnie. Uh, uh. Whew. Max, are you okay? <gasps> oh, you scraped your elbow. I have a bandage. Oh, I can't look. Does it hurt? Maybe I should call a doctor. It doesn't seem to be anything serious, but why don't you take Max to see Dr. Boo Boo gone, just in case? Dr. Boo Boo gone. I can't wait to get back to the carousel. It's just a scratch. Max will be fine. Maybe you should ride a gentler horse next time. Nah, I want to go back and ride Bronco until he comes alive. Come on, Emmy. That's my little brother. What's the matter, Max? I thought you wanted to ride Bronco right away. What if I ride Bronco and fall off again? It's okay if you don't want to ride right now. We can do something else just as fun. I do want to ride Bronco. It's just... It's just... What, little buddy? I guess I'm... afraid. I know how you feel. I fell off my bike once, and I remember being afraid to ride again. Zach got over it. But I don't know how to get over being afraid. Anyone have an idea? Maybe one of us could ride Bronco first and prove to you that he's safe. We'll volunteer! <laughs> See? It's like when I got back on my bike. Here we go. Wheezy, I don't think we're helping Max. We're so tall. There's no way we can fall off. Maybe I can try. I'm the right size. Whee! See, I didn't fall off Bronco. Riding was fun. Now you try. Okay. Ready? Ready. Stop! I can't ride Bronco. Ord, what do I do? I have an idea. Okay, Max. Hop on my back like you do when we fly. Are we going somewhere? No, I'm gonna be your pony. Ord, a pony? <laughs> I can't wait to see this. <laughs> Wee! Woohoo! Yeah! Hey, Yor, you look hungry. Want some straw? <laughs> <laughs> that was fun, and I wasn't afraid at all. Let's go back to the carousel. I'm sure I'm ready to ride Bronco now. Everybody ready? No! What's the matter? I still can't ride Bronco. You rode me. I know, but I knew you wouldn't let me fall off. Max, if you don't want to ride Bronco, you don't have to. Really. But I do want to. I have an idea. Oh, Zach, sometimes your ideas are as good as mine. What is it? Wait here. Uh, we'll be right back. Don't move. Look, Ord. What do you think they're doing? I can't look. I'm not supposed to move. <laughs> <laughs> here they come. Ta-da! Wow. wow. Those are really big acorns. I don't understand. <laughs> Watch! Wow! You made elbow and knee pads! But what about something for Max's head? 
A helmet? I know just the thing. There! Now if you fall, you won't get hurt. Thanks, everybody. This time I'm really, really, really ready to ride Bronco. I'll be right here. Um, Emmy, wouldn't it be fun if you rode with me? I'll feel better, too. No problem. Ready? Ready! Ready! <sighs> You're doing it, Max! <laughs> right up, cowboy! Whoopee! Wait, stop! What is it? Want to get off? Nope. I'm ready to ride Bronco by myself now. Okay, Emmy? Definitely. Seen. Come back anytime. See you later. Oh, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. <laughs> and all because of you, Max. You were afraid, but you wanted to ride Bronco, and you didn't give up, and and you got back on Bronco. Took the words right out of my mouth. Both of our mouths. I bet if Max had a badge, it would be glowing right now. She's right, Max. I wish, I wish to use this ride to go back home until next time. Better get out of your chato outfit, Max. It's almost time for dinner. No way! I'm gonna wear this to dinner and to bed and to school tomorrow. <laughs> oh, Max. Bluest friend you've ever had. Oh, hop aboard the back of board. You know it won't be bad. He'll do the loop, he loop right through the air with a great big laugh and a oh yeah. Do the oh shuffle. Round and round we go. Do the oh shuffle. Round and round we go. He give you great big hugs, but don't mention bugs. Do the oh shuffle. Dragon in the land And if you ever need a friend, my friend You know he's there to lend a hand That's right. He'll do a loopy loop right through the air With a great big laugh and a Oh yeah! Do the oh shuffle Round and round we go Do the oh shuffle Get into the flow He really loves to eat But he's light on his feet Do the oh shuffle Shuffle to the left Shuffle to the right Flying across the floor 
Santos. I know, I know. I'm coming. Huh? It's starting to glow, Emmy. Phew. Ready. Uh. I wish, I wish with all my heart to fly with dragons in a land of heart. We have to be there the minute it opens! We've never been on a ride like that before. That's because it's new, silly. Let's go! No way! I don't like new rides. I'm only going on rides I've been on before. Aw, Zacky. Hey, where's Ord? <laughs> Where else? Blue Shack! <laughs> Granola on a stick? Thank you. Ooh, that looks good. I want a snack too. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Zack? Wheezy? What's the matter? Don't you want to try all the different snacks? Yummy in my tummy! Nope. No! But they have cheesy logs, frozen bananas, nutty mini apples! Mmm, these apples are really good. You should taste one. Hmm. Oh, come on, Zacky! No way! I've never tried that kind of food before. That's why I brought this along. Peanut butter and dragonberry. Mmm! Well, at least let me try something new. No, Wheezy! You might give us both a tummy ache. Here, want half of my sandwich? <sighs> I suppose it's better than nothing. Oh. <laughs> Oh, I'm stuffed. Couldn't need another bite. Uh-oh. I'm still hungry. I should have brought more sandwiches. Watch out. Zack gets kind of grumpy when he's hungry. Oh. I do not! 
<laughs> uh, okay, maybe a little. If you're still hungry, Zack, maybe you should at least try some of the park's yummy food. I don't know, Cassie. I don't like to try new things. <sighs> I bet you've tried lots of things that were new until you got used to them. Uh, like what? Like flying in a race? Or swimming in a lake. Yeah. Weren't you happy after mm -hmm. you tried flying and swimming? I guess. Maybe I could try something new. Uh, but what if I don't like it? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Uh, I'll eat it. <laughs> 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 don't worry, Zack. If you don't like what you try, you don't have to finish it. Oh, all right. I am hungry. Love it! One cheesy log for my friend, please. Thank you. Ew! It looks so... so... Mm, cheesy? No, loggy. Go on, Zack. Just try one bite. Mm -hmm. oh. Well? Hey, doesn't taste as bad as I thought it would. Oh. But I think I've had enough. Uh, I'd like to try something else, please. Ooh, a frozen banana! Mm. Oh. No, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. What else do you have back there? <laughs> Zach, try this. It's my favorite. Corn cob on a stick. On a stick? Hmm. I don't know. Oh. Hey. Um. Oh, yeah. Now, this is good. Oh. Hmm. This is really good. Oh. He likes it. Oh. Zach, he really likes oh. it. Hmm. I'm so glad I tried all those new foods. Cobs on a stick are so tasty. I'm glad you tried something new, too. Uh, excuse me. Are you ready to try out the new rides now? Oh, uh, I don't know. Come on, Zack. You tried the new foods. Yeah, Zack. You might have fun. Well, if you think so. Then let's go. <laughs> <laughs> Up, just like the new food. But I'm glad I tried. Me too. What are we going to do next? Maybe I'm ready to try. The Skipper! to try new things. Oh, Zack, I'm so proud of you. Oh. 
Dragon Tales, visit PBS Kids at pbskids.org. Emmy wished on a dragon scale, and that's what started Dragon Tales. They climbed on the backs of the dragon friends, now the adventures never end. Dragon Tales, Dragon Tales, it's almost time for Dragon Tales. Emmy wished on a dragon scale, and that's what started Dragon Tales. They climbed on the backs of the dragon friends, now the adventures never end. Dragon Tales, Dragon Tales, it's almost time for Dragon Tales. Come along, take my hand, let's all go to Dragon Land. Kellogg's Fruit Loops is proud to sponsor programming that stimulates children's growth and sense of adventure. Kellogg's Frosted Flakes, where they think fun and learning with friends is a big part of what makes life great! This program is funded in part by a Ready to Learn grant from the U.S. Department of Education through the Corporation for Public Broadcasting.